Alright everyone, this is a quick run through with an Ibanez Iceman HR Geiger edition. You can see the cool graphics on it. It's an IC HRG2. Uh, there were only 150 of these made. I've sold this thing, um, but I wanted to play with it for a few minutes first. <laughs> I think it's cool sometimes to have a video of, of things that you've sold just so that you know at least that when you packed it and shipped it it was working. <laughs> Plus this thing's this thing's kind of a blast. It's a it's the same scale as a Les Paul. Look at that neck. That thing's crazy. It's crazy straight. Um, the frets are really nicely leveled and it, it plays quite well. I like being able to blend the pickups with a separate volume control so that you can get a pretty good clean tone with like 80% on the 100% uh, you know, on the bridge pickup and like 80 on on the neck pickup. So it's full neck pickup there it is. A little thicker but I like to roll it a little bit. That should get me a pretty decent classic rock tone. It's got some gain to it. I just rolled the gain on my Marshall down to uh, 10 o'clock. So if you ever see one of these, or, and if you're a sci-fi fan, it's a good guitar to have. This is just a stock Ibanez AH-1 and AH-2 um, humbucking pickups. And they sound decent for what they are, you know, and, you, and they're standard size. You could upgrade them to anything you want. Um, the binding's a little odd on this thing. I don't know, don't know if you can see it, but it's, it matches. It's kind of like a, I don't know. It, Almost looks like an abalone look to it, and you can barely barely see the side markers. That would be a uh, really tough for me on stage. But if you don't care much about side, uh, side dots and all that, it's a really cool looking guitar. All right, have a great evening.